make sure we're streaming here. Okay, we look good. I'm sorry, I'm talking to Punch right now and getting lots of cool stories. Hey, Raj! Sorry, I'm a little disjointed at the beginning of this stream. But we're just, we're just chilling for a moment. My chair's not even in the right place. I feel very uncomfortable right now. <laughs> It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Um, hi, how are you, Ross? Happy Sunday. I am having a good day. I had mass this morning and then a potential roommate came over to take a tour of the apartment. So we'll see what she thinks of that. Um... You know, it's always a little bit weird. Oh, a new church. Was it pretty? Was it nice? Let's see if we've got anything else going on. Oh, I need more arrows. I use a lot of arrows. Firebombs. My new favorite thing. I'm out of them, though. Right, yeah, that makes sense. I understand well enough time zones and stuff. I am not near any civilization right now. Bummer. All right, well. Okay. Did you like it? We'll just start with that then. Did you like it? I hope there's a place to go. Ah, well, that's good. I um, am better at judging art than I am music. So that's probably why I went, went for that. <laughs> I don't even need my churches to have music. I'm okay with that, weirdly. The nerd in me saw their overhead projector and thought someone spent way too many hours in manual work creating that. <laughs> we could use you at our church. They insisted on getting a second screen and then also um, they want wireless for the church. There's currently no internet whatsoever. And nobody knows what they're doing. <laughs> it's like, why? Why are you doing this? <laughs> anyway, we're continuing right when we left off. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. Find and steal the formula from General Agricola. I can kill him, right? I guess that's what, uh, when I was talking to Vitruvius, he was like, I can't be complicit in you killing a Roman general, but you do what your conscience is, which is stab him. What? What is up with your outfit? You do not look very Roman, sir. I hate to break it to you. I also hate that you have like massive amounts of HP and now all your friends are helping you. Oh, this is bad. 
Oh, and there's a level 35, dude. Okay, we gotta, we gotta reassess things here. That's not, that's not very good. Whoa, whoa. This won't even, I'm inside. I can't climb up the walls inside. At least I got you back into this room. This is a more secure position. I like it. That's like strategy. Is that a smoke bomb? Did someone just throw a smoke bomb at me? Razir is lit. Reinforcements are coming. Why don't you use your shield when I tell you to? Okay, whatever. I'm just getting into it. All right. If you want to send some for doing overhead hymn words and such, I don't know. Well, it's already up now, so. And we have a lot of great volunteers on that end who actually know what they're doing. But the internet situation, nobody knows what they're doing. All right, let's shoot him. Well, no, okay. Oh, we've got our manual work guys. They are the best, our maintenance volunteers. We've got plumbers, we've got electricians, we've got builders. But um, it's not wired for internet. There's no connection. So it's uh, a little bit complicated. We, we have a guy who volunteers to do like the office tech stuff. He buys our computers and everything. <laughs> That's true, we do have a lot of people. Although Australia is pretty big, so don't uh, sell yourself short there. For some reason when I was in Australia, I was shocked by how many people there were, or just like how big it was. And I don't know why I was shocked by that. But I was just there, and I was like, this is a very large country. <laughs> Seriously? Wow. Yeah, definitely. Um, that... A hundred people is not huge. <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> the church that I work for has um, about 1,200 families. What? Not both of you. I want this to be an honorable duel. Jerks. Yeah, thanks, Hawk. Eagle. Why does Agrippa have so much HP? How is that possible? You, you don't throw things at me. And then stab me! Oh, oh, oh. Bye, guys. Oops, I desynchronized myself. <laughs> the country is huge. Mainland Australia, mainland USA, roughly the same size. We have 20 odd million people in the whole country. <laughs> yeah, that is a big difference, huh? <laughs> I was only in Sydney, so that's not like a good sense of urban density. Um, <laughs> yeah, a diocese for sure. Wow. I mean, we have a good sized parish. It's not huge. Uh, but it's also not a small parish. 
I would say we have an average parish. <sighs> you. I wish I could assassinate these guys, you know? That would make it a lot easier. Oh! Oh, no, not a photo. Shield. Use your shield, man. But hopefully, if I can take you out, then- Oh, no, that was a big if. That was too big of an if. We're out. We're out. We're running. We're going. We're going. Oof. No, no, get, get. Don't jump, though. Oh, hey, Ryan. I'm dying a lot. This is how this is going now. Wow, they even knew you, even though it's a new church. That's pretty crazy. All right. Sometimes being anonymous in a church is nice because I'm an introvert and I don't want to be greeted by people. I just want to be left to pray. But, you know. I see the appeal. Uh, Splatfest! Well, I appreciate the lurk. Enjoy a Splatoon. Oh, someone saw me. Maybe if I just like kill everybody. That seems like a good solution to my problems. <gasps> yes! This is awesome. Game, you know exactly what I wanted to do. Fortunately, he's on the other side of a building. This guy's still following me, isn't he? Oh, I could disable that, though, so they couldn't get reinforcements. Oh, and there's one of those things! I'm using all of my skills this time. Avoid dance? Explain. <laughs> ah, perfect. You. You're the one I want to kill. See, how much HP does this guy have? That doesn't seem possible to be shot with this and live. And yet. And yet. Okay. <laughs> oh, I think he's got bleeding damage. Oh, that's good. All right. Excellent. Now I can get my thing. Vitruvius's formula. Do not touch. There you are. You're the one who shot me, aren't you? You know what? That's okay. Oh, why did I do that? Stop jumping far more than I want you to. I want to read chat. You hide. Alright. Oh, neat! Thanks, Ryan. Avoidance is a way of life for me. Yeah, for sure. Should destroy the Greek fire stockpiles. Okay. Let's do it. Let's destroy the stockpiles. Just needed a little bit of time to uh, refocus. No. 
Oh, perfect. Go through the window. 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 Yeah. Nope. Don't explain the joke. I mean, I know Terpsichore is one of the muses. I got, I got that. Okay. Destroy barrels. Where are the barrels? Barrels are going to be down there. I don't want to go down there. Anybody I can kill? No. Okay. I have classical knowledge, but even I'm not getting the joke, which is okay. Oh, you didn't move fast enough. It was really the pun that was the problem. The wordplay. That, that I'm not always great at. Wow, I'm really bad at shooting these things. Come on, move, move slightly, not a lot. <laughs> oh! See, I was like trying to remember what Terpsichore would translate as in the Greek, and no, it was not that complicated. I think it just means sweet dance. move way too fast. Oh, there's a person there. Don't mind me. You can't see me. Yes, I believe you are correct as well. On heavy strike. Uh oh, uh oh. This is like not not going well. It was going well, and now it's not. There we go. Very good. <laughs> Wall hacks, yeah. <laughs> okay. So where are the things that I actually need to destroy? I feel like I'm no closer to my objective. Oh, not you. Okay. Oh, nope, it's dawn. People are going to be getting up now. That's bad. 
Like, there's this guy who found all these dead bodies, and it's now like, what's going on? Why were there all these dead bodies here? That was an excellent question. And now you know the answer. I really just want to destroy the Greek stockpiles, though. I don't want to kill you guys. I will. Oh, sweet. Okay. Oh, no! That sounds like it's quite late for you, Ross. Or is it quite early? I don't know what time you normally get up. Where is this thing I'm supposed to destroy? I guess it's that way. Sweet. Nope, nope, we're, uh... Well, I was gonna flee, but my hawk is helping me out. He's actually an eagle. I know. <laughs> Gaming brings out the worst in all of us. Ooh, loot. Speaking of... Loot! By the way, I think I got new dual swords. Yep, there you go. Very nice job. When you're a robot, you don't sleep. I mean, you're right. Where? Is it in there somewhere? It must be. It must be like right here. Do you think? Oh! Look, I'm covered in oil. I'm gonna get lit on fire so many times. Did I kill everybody yet? I might have killed everybody. Oh, no! Somebody saw me. Somebody's not dead. Oh, and that person also isn't dead. Whoa. Okay, nice. No. <laughs> I'm just like confusing these guys. They're like, wait a minute. Where did they go? About a strain. Wait. Where are you doing? Will someone explain to me the Leroy Jenkins thing? Because I see it all the time, and so I know it's a joke, but I have no idea what it is. Yes! Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, Ryan. <laughs> I, I'm, like, looking at chat conversation and not thinking that it's directed to me. I'm just thinking you guys are talking to yourself. Yes, I am. Um, I'm going to finish today. I'm going to finish today. 
warrior bow. Do I use warrior? Why did you already have two? Okay. Team was discussing tactics and going, okay, we are in here, then there, we cast this, do this, we have decent odds of taking down this boss. I'm just gonna destroy everything. Seems the safest plan when I'm not sure what I'm destroying. Well. Hey, where's the other one? Is it this? Did I destroy them all? Nope. It says it's still something here. Then this one guy suddenly comes on AFK, streams his name, and runs straight in without any tactics. Oh. Okay, so Leroy Jenkins is like a kamikaze call. I I get it. Jars? Any jars? I really want to destroy these things. I promise. I just don't know how to. Yes! Feel good about that. Okay, it's more about recklessness than deliberately sacrificing yourself. Okay. I get it! I was just like, where does this come from? What does it refer to? I get it now. Oh, they're down there. Oh, they have little flames on the side. That's how I know. I was like, how am I supposed to know what to kill? I am pretty close. Um, so I have this quest, uh, the final wane. So I have to do a couple side quests just to get my level up. Um, but then I have this side quest, and two more, and then the cutscene. So. I don't know. Four hours? I'm not 100% sure. But it seems totally doable today. It also depends on how many times I die, you know. Like, this mission wasn't going super well. These ones? There we go. The Truvius will want to know his formula is in safer hands. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go. I don't need to kill you. I will, but I don't need to. <laughs> I like that, Ryan. That's funny. I mean, I'm all about 
games are fun. So, especially something like Splatoon, like, you're just running around, shooting things. Well, painting things, I guess. I've never actually played Splatoon, but I've watched... <laughs> exactly, Roz. Um, but I've watched, you know, the NPC and you guys play, so... Excellent. I didn't really need to run on that person's table. Alright, Vitruvius. Not to be confused with Velius Pedirculus. We've all learned that yesterday. Plus said there are some simple tactics that can be a lot of fun. Like sneaking into your enemy's base and then wrecking face when they think they're safe. True. Hey, Vitruvius. Fine. Did you find it? Did you find my formula? We did. Egypt will not burn today. Or any day, I hope. And General is written. He didn't make it. He did not give it up willingly. He was a good Roman. But he never understood. That doesn't mean you cannot be a good man. Flavius fed Agrippa's pride and ambition with talk of empires. I fear the path his supporters have taken will end in... Empire is actually just from the Latin word imperium, which means um, the power that you have to command. Yeah. Sounds like an actual math equation, pretty sure. All right. Uh, I think this one will probably be short, maybe. Uh, so we'll see. At least get to level 33. I'm not sure, like, if they'll let you do it, even if you're not level 35 yet. So we'll see. Alright, I'm gonna get a little sweater because it's chilly. Remember the quadratic formula? Vaguely. I took math once. I was good at math. Goodish. Alright. <sighs> Alright, somebody's boyfriend is dead or something. Let's go investigate. That is true. So is, wait, Ryan, I have a question. Um, you, you said there's a difference between inking and splatting. So is splatting, like when you're attacking the enemies? Oh, wow. I don't know which button I hit, but you're what I wanted. Hi, Mr. Cunningham. Yes, was good. I used to know all sorts of formulas and equations and things. 
Now my brain's full of Latin and Greek. It can't can't do the numbers anymore. Oh. Rip. Alright. I've even taken out Ray before and she has an amazing rank. I believe it. She's cutthroat. <laughs> Splat is kill. Okay. Wait, should you actually, like, kill your opponents? I have so many questions about Splatoon. I don't understand it at all. <laughs> I'm like an old lady. Ryan, explain this to your grandmother. <laughs> what do you do in this game? <laughs> all Splats are inking, not the other way around. Okay. And how's your day going, Mr. Cunningham? It's good to uh, see you in chat. Because from the outside perspective, in Splatoon, you run around and cover everything with paint. But I guess it's technically ink. Oh look, I found the restrooms. Good old Romans. This is not a good way at all to go. Why am I doing this? I'm gonna like escape and replan my life here. Cause that was dumb. That was just all around very stupid. I'm glad you're doing just fine, Mr. Cunningham. I'm just gonna go this way. Oh, come on, you can climb over those spikes. Baby. Coward. Yeah, climb- just jump over them. I'm very disappointed in you, Bayek. Oh, look, those people are dead. Oh, that person's really dead. What the heck happened here? This does not look like a quarry. No, it wasn't my fault. Oh, you're dead. I told you. Oh, I have to get out of conflict. Oh, this is gonna take a while. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I see how this goes. Alright, so let's let's see if we can do this. Hint. I don't think I can. Oh, there's so many people shooting arrows at me. Okay, oh! Well, that guy was here and then gone. So that was interesting. Alright. I'll kill them as they come up. That's a good strategy. Where's the leader guy? I want to make sure I take him out, because he's the most difficult. Oh, come, come. Oh my goodness. Thankfully I have magic arrows, but you move very quickly, and you're just like gone. Bye, bye. Are you done now? Really? Perfect. Oh. Excellent. Okay. That's better. Oh! <laughs> Thanks, Ross. I appreciate the Wizard of Oz lyrics. Most sincerely dead. Yeah, explains Platoon. Please. I would I would really appreciate that. Cause all you cool kids play it on the Nintendo. And I'm like, I'm too old for this franchise. But I'm not that much older than all you guys, so that's probably not true. Somebody shot me. Or stabbed me. Whoa. Oh, he used a smoke bomb. Rude. 
Oh, leave attack, yeah. Okay, so we're pretty much the same age. I'm 33, I'll be 34 in, uh... Wait, no! I am 34! I'll be 35! Wait? Is that right? Oh my lord, I'm gonna be 35 in April! <laughs> that was an unpleasant realization that I just had. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's okay. Everything's okay. Ah, oh, Roz, good. How is it from 35? I mean, you're in Australia, so you live in the future anyway. Uh, that's how that works, you know. You're basically the same age as me. You're just in Australia. Oh, I would love to do a leap attack. Now you're too far, for sure. Okay. Ah, oh, 35 in February! Oh, so you're older than me by like two months. It was a big discovery, Mr. Cunningham. I don't feel okay about this. <laughs> I'll be fine. I'll be fine. The future's not killed you yet. Okay, that's good. 35 is still good. Good, good. In every case, you move best in your own team, Inc. We're, oh, okay. So it affects your movement. It's always helpful to shoot the ground. Okay, right. Even if the ground is uncovered, so you can move faster. Okay. You are told the goal in each mode. If it's not more ink, okay. Alright, yeah, more ground than the enemy, okay. My horse can't come here, okay. Excuse me, I'm just gonna go right out the front this time. Oh wait, I'm only going here? Oh. Okay. It's just a fetch quest. Oh, Alright. But how do you, like, kill people? Which sounds horrible when I say it like that. <laughs> but you were saying that <laughs> splatting um, is like inking, but but there's killing involved. And that doesn't seem friendly. You can use different weapons and outfits. All right. That all makes sense. Cover ground and kill others. Okay, so you do kill people. It's paintball, but you also paint the ground and not just the people. Okay. You splat by shooting others as opposed to the gun. Oh, okay. Why you have to kill others? I know why you're here, my guy. She's dead, isn't yes, she? Yes, she is. Have to. I mean, I'm sorry. There was a rebellion at the quarry, you know. No, I don't want to know. She was always so hot headed. How could he leave us this way? I found his bracelet. He meant for you to have it. What good is a bracelet? My Oof. child will grow up. I'm sorry, lady. That's hard. Thanks for telling me. You are a good mom. But please, leave me alone to my grief. I'm just another woman the Romans have made a widow. This is a war no one speaks of. Alright, sorry. I gained a sweet level, so that's good. They'll force the enemy back to their spawn point. Oh. So if somebody kills you in Splatoon, you don't have to stop working. Um.
Yeah, that's that's a question I was trying to get to, Roz, but um, I'm also playing a game and my brain can only handle so many things at once. Okay. But you do, in theory, get to keep coming back and helping your team even after you get killed, so you're not out permanently. Because that would be sad. Okay. Okay. Alright. That makes sense. Oh, I'm gonna stop there for my fast travel. Oh, look at this! Oh, that's neat. Ooh. Okay, sorry. I got distracted by maps. That happens a lot in my life. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully just another side quest or two, and then we'll... Maybe even just this one. I don't feel the need to be at level 35. It will certainly help, but... I don't think it's necessary either. Cool. Can you make it? Oh, good horsey. Okay. I don't blame you. That that was a tough one. I'll take it from here. My horse does not know uh how to climb walls and that's okay. I thought you were going to make a joke about matchmaking, Ross. I was slightly disappointed that your answer seems logical. I, I think by ping time, Ross means, like, connection. Yeah, because that's the problem that Smash Brothers is having right now. Um, the lag is terrible. I don't know if they've improved it since last time that I watched people play it, but it was not good. Yeah, that does help. Thank you so much, Ryan. Does anybody else have questions about video games? <laughs> that's what that's what video game streaming is for. And I don't mind asking you guys my stupid questions like who is Leroy Jenkins and how do you play Splatoon? How is our brave widow? Good, as you can see. Small victories and joys like these, we take them where we can. Bayek, Flavius was killed. But that is not the worst of it. Mothers and wives of the temple are sick and wailing in the streets. They're pleased to see their loved ones unanswered. In Flavius' case, it cannot be a <laughs> no. That could totally be a slogan for my channel, Roz. We learn the most random things ever. It's true. Melita! Like Melita! So the double T can also be written as a double S, depending on your accent in Greek. And so Melita is the same as Melissa, which means bee or honey. 
Ta-da! Now you know. That's good that matches are smooth in. In Splatoon. And I'm sure eventually they'll figure out the Smash situation. It just is cruddy right now. Wood! Yes! Okay. See you later. Yeah, there are no stupid questions here. As a teacher, I appreciate that. And by that I mean... There are no such things as stupid questions. Because even though sometimes questions seem pretty stupid... It is better than not knowing, because then you can learn, and learning is the best. Oh, I still need three wood for the bracer. Bummer drag. Oh, I want to know this, this Ross tweet. Let me, let me check this out. <laughs> Uh, I appreciate that tweet very much. And they are fun. Um, I mean, sometimes if it's, like, stupid because you've answered the question, like, five times, it can be a little bit frustrating. Like, weren't you listening when I said this the other four times? But I guess what I really appreciate are the random questions. You know? Uh, I mean, stupid questions are good because stupid. Right? They're not really stupid. Uh, but a lot of times the, the questions that people feel stupid asking are really good because they're missing some... Right, it's, it's something we didn't actually cover or... Um... Like, there's just some difficult concept that hadn't quite clicked. And so you need to go over that, which is fine, because you have to review information to learn it. So it's part of the process, right? We gotta, we gotta get that. But I also really like the random questions. Like, this isn't really related, but kind of related. But you mentioned this thing, and now I'm wondering, did the Romans ever do X? And I'm like, I have never thought about that question in my life. <laughs> I don't know. That's probably the thing that I miss about teaching. Like, actually just, like, hanging out with students and, you know, learning about the world together. Like, oh. Fascinating. Yes! Oh, that sounds like a great group. No, I don't want to parkour up. I want to go into the window. In the window. In the window. No, that was down. That was all the way down. Disappointed. Where, where are we? Who are we visiting? They're over there. Okay. Oh, of course there's body parts here. Okay, let me explain. I, for a minute I thought this was a statue workshop. And that's why there were all these pieces here. I forgot that we were going to the Asclepion. Um... Yeah, and yeah. I mean, you're definitely right there. I love my adult students whenever we would get them. But, so Asclepius was a god of medicine. He was a healing god, a son of Apollo. 
And so people would, like, if you had, like, a sore, like, a broken foot or some sort of back problem or, like, cancer or something, you would put, a, you would dedicate um, a statue part of what was sick. So, like, if I had a broken arm, I would put a terracotta arm in the statue in the in the temple so that he would um, heal my arm. Yep, that's Asclepius. Or, if you're Roman, Aesculapius, which is just so much more fun to say, Aesculapius. Melita, the viper of the star. No. No, my I like all the cats Daniel. too. Please. Okay, I oh I, I'm taking you to the clinic. Okay. Ice coolopius. <laughs> Ice coolopius. <laughs> it does sound like that. I you never thought about that before. <laughs> Uh, but some, oh, I would just like to climb out the window, but I guess I can't do that with carrying this guy. Well, one of my favorite, well, I have a lot of favorite things, so I shouldn't preface anything with one of my favorite things. Do I just, like, throw him off the edge to get down? That seems unsafe. Is there a way to go down that isn't out a window? Shout if you guys see it. Hey, kitty. I don't... Okay. There's a window. Any doors? Oh, here we go. Whew. Um, but I do love the differences between the Greek and Roman names. Um, so, like... Another really fun one. Most of them aren't that fun. They're pretty minor. Um, or they're just totally different. But Persephone, which is the daughter of Demeter and the wife of Hades, and you know, a lot of people know her story. Um, her Latin name is Proserpina. Proserpina. There you go. Here you go. I brought him. The cat followed me too. All right, all right. Just keep your voice down. She left to speak to the priestess. <laughs> I have so many favorite things. Has <laughs> them. She keeps them hidden. Lies in whispers. Secrets shrouded. I think you might be insane. Oh, I, I don't remember what I said. Now I'm gonna have to watch this clip. A moment for the clip break. really good that distraction uh, <laughs> uh okay i also wanted to stop at the um, somewhere around here was the this cat is like my friend now Kitty? Yes. I can't take you out of Egypt. That's illegal. Alright, where are you? How can I help you? Crafting materials, please. I'm out of money. 
No. Here we go. We're fine. Do I have enough? All the cats. Yay! I can carry more tools. Let's see. Not really exciting. Maybe I'll just hold on to it. Because I kind of need that hard leather for other things that I like more. Never mind. <laughs> A new challenger. Is that like intentional Smash reference? Killing cat. Oh my goodness. I, I mean, I am less obsessed with cats than many people are on the internet. Which, like, means nothing. Um, but they're pretty cute. I won't lie. My roommate, one of my roommates in grad school had kitties. And that was nice. Oh, you don't know Ceiling Cat. Oh. It's part of the uh, I Can Has Cheeseburger lore. It is the I Can Has Cheeseburger Cat God. Kind of. <laughs> they are evil, most of them. My roommate's cats were surprisingly not evil. Um, so I'll always give them a reference. I mean, I'll give her cats props for that. There are certainly many, many not very kind cats, but I am more of a dog person. That always surprises people. I'm a tea drinker, but a coffee, but a dog person. I break the stereotypes, man. <laughs> yeah, you do have to like Don't be seeing any not not cave to the cat's wishes. Oh, I totally like you were like not and you're just like kicking the dirt. Oh, you didn't die. Oh, because you're level 36. You're both level 36. I'm not even sure if I should be killing you. I apologize. But not enough to stop. Because now it's survival. Okay. Oh. That's good that you could train your cat to do that. Because usually... Cats and computers? A secret in the mountains. I pray Praxila and the others are alright. I don't even know why I killed you. I'm sorry. I feel guilty. But maybe you're, you were evil. You were guarding this thing that I'm supposed to go check out. I can only assume that means you were evil. Assassinate. Okay, yep, I'm totally. <laughs> My morality in this game is very questionable. <laughs> I'll let you guys out. I mean, my morality in video games in general is pretty questionable. I'm I'm not proud of the choices that I make sometimes. You should be grateful. You turn the world. Oh, I need a and the work will be over soon. Oh, now you're moving. Don't 
Don't move. I just light him on fire just to call him. Shot too soon. Okay. Oh, wow. I'm almost dead. Wow, that that was bad. I wasn't even paying attention to my health. <laughs> I got desynced. <laughs> yeah, that was... I noticed some of my shots were a little low. And yet it didn't do that much damage. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and Ryan, I mean, video games are no place for morality. Um, true, but at the same time, it's fascinating when your morality does kick in. So, it's a fascinating discussion. One that probably needs an actual discussion. Oh, wait. Can I kill you guys? Do you have hard leather? No, you're just going to be goats. Goats going to go. Okay. <clears throat> anyway. Oh, yes, my standards. <laughs> <laughs> and sometimes Ryan um, you know it just like can vary so much game by game and like but I guess that's true of all entertainment like you don't necessarily agree with anything uh, in some sort of piece of entertainment but it might still be worthwhile, but then other times it's like, no, that's, that's not okay. So it's fascinating. <laughs> it's an important clip. I think Frost has shown it often in my channel. <laughs> How do I get in here? It seems to be right inside, so I don't know where the game started me at. Where do I go? Also very true. Like, I'm playing as Bayek. He's killing a lot of people. Those are choices I would not have made myself. There we go. Yeah, also that's true, Ryan. I'm just going to climb this mountain, I think, because I don't know how to get in to the compound. So we're just going to keep going further away. Look, there's pyramids and there's uh, somebody's house or something. Very nice. Any, any way I want to get in here? Senu, help me out. I'm, I'm super lost here. I don't know where they started me. Where can I get in? Oh, why am I flying the wrong way? Oh my goodness. Oh, oh! That's bad. I can't even fly Shanu. I'm never gonna beat this game. <laughs> get me out of here.
Alright, some games you find with you are doing this. Like, keep talking, nobody explodes. Well, yeah, that's fine. There's no moral decisions in there. Yeah, that is... That is a fun game game. <laughs> Breath of the Wild is fantastic. Mr. Cunningham said that he wanted to see me play it on the channel, so... That will probably be happening sometime. Um, but I don't know that I ever got this lost in Breath of the Wild. I feel... I just feel so lost. All alone. It is beautiful. I really enjoyed it. Hmm. Alright. Oh. Reach some barracks, which is exciting, I guess. I really am not sure where the entrance to this game went. Whoa, your favorite game ever, ever? Oh, come on. Where do I get in? Probably this way. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, Ross. <sighs> and that's big, Ryan. Your favorite game ever, ever. It, the lyrics sound vaguely familiar, so I, I might have heard the song. Oh, come on. Hey, guys, how do I get into the cave? Do you know? Can I just go through here? I will. I'll go right through here. He's gonna blow me up! Rude! That was unnecessary, but I was frustrated, so... There we go. There's my morality. I was frustrated, so I killed a man. Okay, let's go. Australian group. Okay, maybe I haven't heard it. The Seekers doesn't sound familiar anyway. Well, I would love to hear your reasons why, because I'm not getting out of this side quest for a while, Ryan, so feel free to, to let us know what it is that you love about Breath of the Wild. Okay. Oh, is that the song? Sweet, thanks. If I can't find the entrance to this, I'm just going to do a different quest. <laughs> because I don't know where it went. It's like this one quest in Horizon Zero Dawn I wasn't able to do. Because I just couldn't climb up this wall. And I was like, um, pretty sure I have to go this way. Everybody enjoy the the pretty mountain. She's inside it somewhere. The 
of Zelda games, love open world, physics are implemented, free reign to play and explore. Yeah, man. Why? Why? He's like right beneath me. Beautiful world, good story, characters. Yeah, I didn't have any problems with the with the story and the characters. I thought it was very nicely done. I mean, it got one of the Game of the Year awards, and I think it totally deserved it. Um, I quit. Jesus. <laughs> this game does not want me to win. Okay, I'm getting closer, and then we'll just disappear. Oh, you got the Wii U. All right, whatever. Sorry, guys. We're gonna go to Cyrene. No, you're thinking of the Dioptra. That's what we rebuilt for Vitruvius. <laughs> All right. Buy it. The Magi from Siwa. Not that I really plan to do any more side quests. I'm going to try and beat it. I could not stay there after what happened. I cried for the people we left behind. The Diacol would be two monocles. That's true. He met a creature. Sadly, that's not what that means in <laughs> Greek. <laughs> Diocles would just mean like glory of Zeus. They were captured attacking the port. Our ancestors shared the Wahadi. Where do the Romans have an army? Oh, yeah. There is a place on the road to Cyrene where they inflict the cruelest punishment. Oh, man, don't get me started on Phantom Menace disappointment hype. <laughs> I have a lot of that. Um, yeah, I. I mean, I really agree. It's such a beautiful game. I did not have the Virtual Boy, nor did I have Wii U. Those are the ones I missed. It does, it does. I mean, it is. All right, perfect, let's go. We're going to Cyrene. Oh, that's true. The little 
little Nintendo community we have is really fabulous. Oh, a crucifixion site. Fascinating. Or you can do what my, uh, what my student's brother did. And he got a Wii U for cheap so he could play Breath of the Wild on the Wii U. <laughs> And I was like, that's smart. I mean, Breath of the Wild is definitely a big open-world adventure game, for sure. This place... the shrine... it prickles with divine power... the oracle... Well, they already have a coliseum over here? I can feel it. That seems... unlikely? For several reasons. But okay. Here we go. You don't have to fall down that way, you can... Any... ones that I want, though. Nope. Oh, is this like bandits? Or Romans? Bandits? I'm not in like a site. Yay! I'm glad that you D and D. I think we talked about that. I don't even know who these guys are. Let me kill you. Oh, my goodness. Now I'm on fire. That's bad. That's really bad. Not worth it. I don't even know why I'm fighting you. Enjoy your lurk. I don't know if you're sleeping or getting food or going to hang out with uh, Stardust, but enjoy. Enjoy your lurk. Arena, obviously. Most places in the eastern part of the Empire, which this would become, of course, did not have uh, amphitheaters. 
they just use um, theaters and large open areas. Oh, where are you? There we go. That's your side quest, sir. Get many Egyptians in Cairo. You'll get no judgment from the mouse, but you did speak out. The mouse? The mouse. Because he's smint us. Yes, yes, I am the mouse because I can access the more hard to find trinkets. Also, because your name is Smintus. See what you have, Mouse. Don't you have trouble with the Romans? Well, you know what they say about our Latin friends? The Greeks invented the threesome, and the Romans added women. <laughs> oh my goodness, what a joke. Sorry. I know how to say <clears throat> We're gonna ignore that guy. Came back from Balagre with a crook up his ass. Demanded my taxes for the year. They burned my farm when I refused, and you are sure it was Leander's men. My wife said no good would come of defying him. I hate it when he bribes. Leander will pay. You have my word. Your word, Diocles? Will that sow my sports field? Bring my goats back to life? I am done with you. <laughs> There's been a lot of lines. Your word. Oh, yeah, that line. Goodness gracious, Synthus. And how has our most venerated magistrate extorted you, Egyptian. Praxila said you could help me. I am Bayer. You're very young, Diocles. Are you sure you're old enough to be responsible for anything? Is your right? As well as anyone can be with desecrating your land. I followed that fucker's murderous trail all the way from Siwa. So the rumors? True. As are his preparations for war. One more oppression. Egypt will never be stable again. Invasions upon invasions. Flavius will make of Egypt one giant tomb. He rules from the Acropolis, but is crawling with Romans. I pray the dice fall in your favor, Bayer. I must deal with this laptop, the magistrate Leander. Take me out again, if you would be a friend to Cairo. Thank you, Diocles. It is time for my son to enter the field of ruins. Alright, let's go kill him. Where are you? Dad, they promised. I like Cyrene. This is an alright place. And it's certainly been Greek a very long time. Because Pindar is talking about Cyrene and a few of his poems. Apollonion. Let's go up to the Acropolis. This area is unfinished. Come on, there's these things. Looking okay. Yep, 
Okay, we're all full up there. This is awesome, but that's not the way I need to go. There's this guy. We're gonna go kill him. They're a little bit over leveled, so I can't just assassinate them. And by they're over leveled, I mean I'm under leveled. That's okay. Good. All right, good. Oh, not good. Is it just the one? Just the one. Oh. Okay, good. <clears throat> now I have to actually figure out how to get in, though. Anybody? I'm just gonna keep doing this. Oh, here we go. Yeah, go in, go in one of the windows. Oh, okay, when you're going through the glacial lands. You're getting really close to the end. What, like two more chapters left? Essentially. For my son's death, Roman. No. Yeah. Aw, Tenebrae. That's so sad. We'll bow before your god. What? I don't even understand what my son, my the purpose <laughs> of this overall plot is. Why didn't you well, you disappear. Why don't you? Whatever, whatever. We'll we'll figure out how to use the buttons eventually. Oh. Laser beam. Whoa, why did I don't even know, man. There's like a whole bunch of them. There's a whole bunch of these fake priests. Okay. What? What? Why? Whoa! 
okay. Yeah, indeed. The whole back half of the game seems pretty... Tragedy befalling the bros. Yeah, for sure. It is, it is sad times, for sure. And poor Ignis. I'm just always sad about Ignis. Yeah, I know they're nothing but tricks, but you're the one who keeps fighting them. I don't know how to untrick them. Oh! Oh, there he's back. Alright. Alright, it took a moment, but we're back. Do that thing, and then I stab you. You're oh! To farmer. Camel herders and shit shovelers. That is all Egypt is. Oof. Oof. Where are you? Yeah, you, you go ahead and use your superpowers. See how much I care. Oh my goodness. Are you? It's a little hard to tell with the funky light. I'm getting closer. What the? What was that? The fake priests are back, and now they're all the other people that I've killed. I'm feeling very trippy right now. I'll read chat when I'm done killing. Oof! 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 Come on, get up! You were behind me. Oh no. These people are very rude. These ghosts of people I've already killed. Very annoying. Oh! You were there the whole time. doing this thing okay oof well I didn't mean to shoot an arrow oh oh it's getting bad Not the ones, 
What is he doing? Oh! Yes! I did it! Confirmed kill! Alright. I I knew the plot to 15 from when it originally came out. The stuff with Prompto and Arden on the train seemed like it was really apparent. I I actually had no clue what was happening with Prompto and Arden. So I felt really dumb when it apparently was obvious to other people. I was going like, what the what are you doing? Your son's death makes the order bow to me. Caesar is I had Rome. The bias life choices are not good choices. Yeah, poor Ignis. Oh, even Bayek started to freak out. It's all right, Captain. No. I will lose you forever. Good friend. I will be waiting for you in the field of war. Excellent. Look, they're all dead now. Doesn't that feel good? I just thought the dialogue didn't fit Arden at all. I mean, you're right, and in retrospect, um, it, it's definitely a lot more clear, um, but Arden is super weird that I was just like, why are you being weird, Arden? <laughs> you know, it just, <laughs> that seemed the easier explanation uh, than he has somehow stitched time and is prompto. All right. Uh, let's go to Alexandria, shall we? So now we're in the home stretch here. Yeah, and so the, um, you know, I watched Kingsglaive and I watched the Brotherhood anime, um, but I did not know that there were supposed to be time stitching in alternate dimensions. That, that was not something I knew. So. So that's something that they kept from the earlier development then? Is that what you're kind of, is that what you are saying? Because I did not follow it at all, pretty much until um, they started releasing King's Glaive and Brotherhood. Then I, then I was watching it stuff. Oh, 
Jesús. Are you inside? No. Maybe you are. Hiya, where are you? Why are you in here? I have questions. Oh, I guess this is the secret area. Back from the beginning of the game. Forgot about that. I don't think it's been that long. Flavius is dead. I have gone to shit to get our son out of this one. Kemu was at peace. Then he went and killed Flavius. I had to run for him. Run? You still entertain folly with these ambitions? I have made mistakes. You have made yeah, mistakes. Yeah, why are you going to Rome? That doesn't that's not a good idea. Brutus? Your energy. Ah. You are the famous Magi. Thanos never ceases to speak of your exploits. I what? have assembled a group. This is Brutus and Cassius. Brutus and Cassius? <laughs> oh my goodness. scoundrel across the sea. The Simeon. The Caesar. The Order is no longer an Egyptian problem only. Does Cleopatra still rule? There is no ruler in Egypt. Plunged into the will of various times. Well. Queen. Guess we're gonna go assassinate Caesar. Nothing has changed. Memphis is overrun by the Order. I am. We need you. Oh, let's put that in with some other junk. Nobody will find it there. All right, time to speak to you one last time. That's sad. So those things were intended according to post-game interviews and presentations, and that one weird trailer where Regis talks to an unknown person at the end. I don't remember that one, which doesn't mean much. I don't follow the news too closely. I think it's just an effort not to like spoil the game for me. I'll just read, uh, you know, wikis later if I have questions about things. Where's my horse? Why am I running? Thank you. Now, with the Pocket Edition, you guys don't get access to any of the um, side episodes, right? Ooh, Ooh pretty. It's suddenly daylight. Our victories have multiplied. Our bond not so. We could never have believed. Everything has told us. What? 
You're right. Something bigger has called us. But our love lives in the Duat. Only now we are letting go. Let the gods decide. Oh man. The gods are dead. That's rough. That's a rough breakup. Okay. We must sacrifice our personal lives for the greater good. All this darkness is for a reason. Yeah, so it is very linear then. The reckless in public without killing. The the one. We must work in the shadows. Yeah. Also. You can control the camera. Oh, sweet. We fall too. All will fall to the crib, yet no one will know. When we assassinate, we assassinate only those who deserve it. We choose sick souls who try to control us. But they will never know who we are. Cold, calculated, poets of the kill. Okay, here they do. Here they do the the Assassin's Creed. I am an evil one. Yes. We are the hidden ones. We sharpen our blades and pull what hope is left from this foul earth. It's really depressing. You guys made sad choices, and I feel sorry for you. Oh, and look, it's the assassin symbol from the game. Aww. That was on you, Aya, let's be honest. Oh, well that was short. So now we only have one quest left, and then one cutscene quest. Hello. I am the person that you do not care about in this game. You have played as me for about 10 seconds. It's not the ending yet, there's still two more quests. Those don't need to be your last words. Who the fuck are you? Ugh! Dude. Does the name William Miles ring a bell? No. Assassin? Then you know who I am. We, the assassins, have been watching you. It's unusual for an Ostergo employee to take an interest in the country's revolution. You're not wrong there. What the what is happening? Your work with the animus. Fun, I tried to run cars off the road <laughs> so you can turn. They played you, didn't they? Sophia Rickon made you. <laughs> Enough! We're not talking about her. Sure. Plenty of other subjects to cover on our ride to Alexandria. Don't assume I'm going anywhere with you. Well, welcome back, Ross! You can come with me, or you can stay here and do the dance of death again and again until you make a mistake. We only need you to make one. We're in this meta narrative, and I have no idea what's happening. I never planned to. And I don't really care either. But We're almost done with the game, though. We have one more quest. Our version of it. And with us. And Bayek and Aya decided that they were going to be separated, but. They would be assassins. That's what you've missed. Fine. Let's do this. That doesn't mean I'm on. I do appreciate that, Ryan. Good enough. You try to work the game in your favor. No, they did not decide to assassinate each other. Okay, I'm gonna get in this because I don't care about. That lady.
I mean, I think she's trying to figure out the history of the Order. And she's just done that. I didn't know you could drift in this game. Sweet, drifting. <laughs> no. Right, and I didn't know you were an assassin. I don't want to talk about that's something that's never come up in our conversations. Let me have it. I'll give it to Foxy that myself. He loves these things. Oh. Oh. Okay. How about that? I'm in no mood for compromise today. Nice. Neapolis is Naples. I can feel no decision is easy. You are a chosen one. And I will free like me. Exactly, Ryan. I don't need to know. I don't want to know. <laughs> and that's all okay. Yep, and Neop Neapolis just means new city. Aww. Hiya. Man. Alright, we gotta do one of these things. <laughs> Ice cream. Neapolitan. This is this is fine. There's no nobody to hit. Oh, I'm Oh man, a Roman fleet up ahead. Bummer. Yeah, she is cold blooded. Like obviously I feel bad for her. Her son was killed, and, you know, that sucks, obviously. Like, I can't even imagine. And I know that tragedy makes, uh, puts a strain on a relationship. But it's like, man, come on, Bike seems like a nice guy. Arrow them other ships. That's gonna be the plan. Well, I'm not trying to hide. Was I supposed to try to hide? How do we duck? I forgot. Where, where, those ones? Yeah, I guess those ones. Oh. That's rough. Fire bombs. Ah. Don't give him ideas. I guess I should, like, try to get closer to them, maybe. That seems like a good strategy. Yes, and definitely true about Bayek as well, like... Bayek and Aya are both going through a lot of emotions. And, uh, it's sad. I think they should learn how to work together. 
I don't like Cleopatra from between you. She's a jerk. Yeah, no, Bo Dude is probably like trying his best. All right. Do not attack allied ships. I was trying not to, but they were in the way, okay? I wonder if they decided to make Assassin's Creed um, Odyssey just because they wanted to do more of these battles. What do you think? Oh, they're coming up behind me. Hold on! I can't quite shoot them. They're like right behind me. <laughs> if this were Battleship, I would probably like it better. Do not attack allied ships. Allied ships do not get in my way. Have you thought about that? Allies, huh? Be more. I mean, let's be honest. They set fire to skip the bonus. Oh God. Oh, I figured Splatfest was just like a tournament. Listen to Tiggy Bomb. They'll hit us. We are overwhelmed. The hell ships are too many. That is a lot of ships. We must sink them before they reach us. Okay. Then two of us if they strike us. Take them down. Oh, they sent out sinking ships. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, and then there's that one. Oh no, oh no. Oh dear. Galley speed, let's go. We 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 hit them, right? Get rid of the fire ships. Oh. Where'd they go? Where'd the arrows go? Oh. If you don't want me to go this way, game, that's on you. can't cut off part of my ocean. That's not how the ocean works. Okay?
Oh, we're just gonna keep holding while they ram into us. Perfect. Alright. I'm playing this, uh, boat simulator, Assassin's Creed. Yeah, I know, right? If we brace, then they don't have a chance. Alright, I think we sank them all. This still so oh, there are two more fire ships, though. Well, boo-hoo. Nobody cares. They're super far away. Come on, let's go over there to sink those so the game will let me continue to roam. I'm sailing to Rome, by the way. We just passed Naples. There we go. Okay. Sink the twin Ro Oh, there's Octoremes. Oh. I can't see how. With our fleet dispersed and our allies gone, we're undone. We're in trouble. Okay, where are they? Oh, those are our allies. True. Oh, let me read chat for a minute. Uh, when you fire arrows, the ships itself that you hit. Octarine Traveler. <laughs> Appreciate it. Oh, I'm still waiting for those to load. Oh, firebombs. Good, they're back. Yeah. Oh. like pretty much sunk. Right? They're sinking, right? I think they're sinking. <laughs> they're not tournaments. Picking two oh yeah, right. Um I remember you guys do like retro and modern and stuff like that. Okay. Oh, uh, Rex, I've been having Ryan explain Splatoon to me. <laughs> because <laughs> I uh, didn't actually know what was going on. And so did they con do they pick the winner of the Splatfest just by looking at all the matches that there have been? over, you know, the 24 hours or however long it is. If that's the other Octarium I have to take down, I think we're okay. Oh, there it is. Further. Okay, this is actually a lot easier than the first time we had a fight in Octarine. So, I don't feel too bad. Do not attack allied ships. Remember, allied ships, get out of my way. We're gonna, we're gonna, oh! Did you just ram me, ally? 
rude. Oh, because you were being rammed from behind. Okay, I'll forgive you this time. Best of three wins between popularity, filthy casual matches, and filthy tryhard matches. Wins and clout points. And what side was picked more? Yeah, for sure. Oh, Antium! That's Actium. Oh, no, it's not. We're talking about something else. I wasn't paying attention. Alright, we're almost in Rome. Gonna wrap up this, maybe, maybe within an hour. Maybe we'll finish. I think we're pretty close. That went super fast. Squid bagged? You use all these words. Oh, here we go. Ides of March, Theater of Pompey. That's not true at all. He's actually already tyrant. They're gonna crown him dictator for life. You're gone. The Senate will not bow to you. A parliament of clucking heads. I don't think you're wrong. He likes the Senate. Who are you? I don't like you. Where's your Caesar? Where's your wife, Caesar? I have a feeling we're gonna be angry in this part. Like, you couldn't get- you couldn't be that well equipped inside of Rome, for example. So Caesar is the king of the order now. Caesar is the father of understanding. The father of understanding? You are meddling with the affairs of the order. The order is greater than Rome. Nothing is greater than Rome. Uh, no, Cretans are liars, Egyptians are not. Get your facts straight. What the- what is this guy? I was he use annals. That's nice. It feels good to start with winners. We are the writers of history. Caesar will follow you to oblivion. Ah, no. Everybody loves Caesar. What the? What you is that attack? No honor. You stole everything from me. I am a Gabiniani. Gabiniani. Scurry away, Lily. You'd have taken your chance to drop off the map. Flavius isn't here to save you this time, Septimius. No Roman deals will be made. Nope. I mean, this isn't super great, but it's okay. gonna do this for a while. Spam him with long distance attacks. That's a good warrior. Okay. <laughs> that was fun, wasn't it, everybody? Oh, come on. There we go. Very good. When in Rome, cheese as the Romans do. <laughs> I like that. Damn you, Lupa. She wolf is Lupa. For your life. With revenge, everything you hope. You and the Magi 
shall drench the sheets with your sweat tonight. <laughs> I don't even what? You guys are very unpleasant. I serve them and your beloved Egypt. And I'll be rewarded in the afterlife. You won't be rewarded in the afterlife. Romans don't care about that. The only thing that waits for you is oblivion. For your name, your order, and the rotten corpses of your Gabignani. I could devour your fetid heart. Okay, well that's done. I'm glad. Yes, um, this is a custom from their city. They have to use a feather. Okay, they don't actually tickle one another to death, but it's a, it's an afterlife thing. Why am I here? I thought I was going to the Curia. Where am I? I've been to Rome. Let's let's see if this makes any sense whatsoever. Alright. <clears throat> so um that's a lot of garden space. Nice fountain. Um Where even am I now? Um, I'm not 100% sure where these buildings are. I'm trying to orient myself. If that's the Curia. Over there somewhere should be like the, well, there's a I'm not sure this is historically accurate. I mean, it's a little bit hard to tell just because it's built up. And, uh, but I don't know. There were a lot more statues in ancient Rome. This looks very garden-y. But maybe we're not in the forum. Where are we? World map unavailable. Are we not in the form Romana? Are we somewhere else? Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, that's unpleasant. Okay. Sorry. I've, uh, gotta... made some mistakes. Alright. Yay! Thank you for putting us on the auto host list. Always a help. Always working now. <laughs> no, they do not have a Starbucks within the Roman Forum. Come on, Rex. Um, right now, the Roman Forum is very, very not built up. You know, it's pretty much a series of small walls. Um, which is fine, but I don't... Again, like, are we in the Roman Forum? Maybe we're not in the Roman Forum. Because none of this looks, uh... Right? Are we at somebody's, like, private estate here? Oh, but we're going to Pompey's Theater! Oh, right! We're not in the Roman Forum. Even though it says to reach the Curia, uh, they, the Senate is meeting in the theater of Pompey. Okay, so that clears up a few things. We are not in the Roman Forum. I mean, historically speaking, we should not be. We should be in, you know, just a more of a residential area. <laughs> Of a Roman form. <laughs> yeah, those were, um, I did not know that was an architectural feature. Look at all those statues. I mean, there were a lot of statues, for sure.
so the theater of Pompey was connected. I'm you know trying to re-get my knowledge here. The theater of Pompey was connected to uh, the temple of Venus. Which Venus? Victrix? Yeah. He, she, he built the temple for Venus Victrix. And that's still not helping me. This giant water feature. They did, I mean, they love giant water features, so. No, no, be in the water, be in the water, be in the water. This is really gross water, and I'm apologizing, but what can I do? Yeah. I mean, I think the Temple of Venus Victrix um, did, along with the theater slash everything, it was a whole, it was a whole thing. I think they did have a water feature. Whoa! I was trying to not make a scene. You know, Caesar is uh, planning on dying, so... Oh! Ran right into that guy. Oh, you stabbed me in the back. So made it here. You can't stop me. Oh, I have to get out of conflict before I can do it. Okay. Nobody knows where I am now. Everything's fine. <laughs> conflict needs to get out of you. That's right. I'm not here. This is fine. This is all fine. Now I can go stab Caesar. Alright. Let's go stab Caesar. A pigeon slash assassin deterrent. Yeah. <laughs> People would notice you like immediately. I'm sorry, not at all. Oh, there we go. Nobody can tell now. I put a hood on. Nobody will notice the rest of my outfit. Oh my goodness, this is ridiculous. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fascinate. Nobody even like stop me. Oh, and there. Everybody else gets a stab too. Now you're gonna die at the um statue. You took my child. Stab him. Yep, there's Brutus. Kaisu Technon. They have nice historical nods. The tyrant is dead, you are free now. But they were supposed to he was supposed to die at the foot of the statue of Pompey. I didn't see that. <laughs> Oh, now he gets his feather. Do I know thee? You who strikes through the shadows. The 
same circle comes with a response. He like wasn't Again? even the worst guy. It is impossible not to become. What else no. You are? No. Caesar would not say that. Was a god. No. That is a new you were like, don't call me a god. People are going to kill me. I don't know. I, I kind of like Julius Caesar for all of his weirdnesses. Yeah. Requiescat in pace, Caesar. And you can still see a lot of the cool sights, and I love Rome. It's a beautiful city. And there's Caesarion. You know what you've done? Caesarion would have sat on the throne of Rome, listened to you cry through the streets, and they call you a dead tyrant's whore. I am still your queen. You are a queen of man. I fought for you for five years. Five years? Wow. Apologies. He died for you, for Egypt. I am Egypt. Oh, oh, oh. Don't kill her. Cleopatra doesn't die for another few years. I'm not going to see you from the wall across from the church. You are the last of the Pharaohs. Well, that's Caesarion. Don't be rude. Let me assassinate Cleopatra. <laughs> Cleopatra.asp. I like it. Hey, Evander. What an appropriate name. So I think this is it. I think we're getting the last cutscene here. Good job, bye -bye. gonna have him do his sweet moves here while we wait for it to load. Oh, here we go. I haven't decided yet. I haven't decided what I will play next Stabby Sunday. I mean, next weekend I might play Kingdom Hearts just to make sure I finish that before Kingdom Hearts 3 comes out. Uh, but I might do Shadow of War. Pantheon! Woo! I love that building. It's beautiful. Bayek. Caesar has been assassinated. Septimius is also dead. I have founded a bureau in the middle of Rome. Yet, no one knows of our existence. Like a Where is your bureau located? Yeah. Is it in the gelato shop? There's the, like the infamous I best Bellagio gelato place is very close to the Pantheon. It's always packed. It's a huge place. The island of freedom. We are free of each other, yet it brings me no happiness. We must move forward. You can Remain in our tempest not be poetry. to um, separate it. All, we dance. And they die. Could like get back together. From darkness we have come, and in darkness we shall stay. Humans are not meant to last forever. But this creed will. The creed is the only immortal thing in the world. Whoa! 
go home. You're free. What if this is our home? Keyblade is a blade. That's true. I keyblade you guys. I go home by myself. I'm scared. Yeah, no kidding. Should we take them to the bureau? Oh, we'll just raise them to be assassins. Yeah! That's good. I'll take you home. Let nothing grieve you beyond measure. Oh, bye, For your life is short and time will claim its toll. But I... I'm no longer who I was. Let nothing grieve you beyond measure. That's a citation. Hey, <laughs> young lady, so no. I have renounced Aya. I have killed Aya. Oh my goodness. I am now the hidden one, known as Amulet. Oh, okay. Aw, I keyblade you, Ryan. That was a depressing end. Yeah. No kidding. May your victory multiply. Poor Bayek. At least he's got Senu and his horse. Papa? Jump. What? New Game Plus has been added. Okay. Well then. That's, um, that's this. I mean, you make a good point, Ryan. I knew it was going to be pretty depressing. For obvious reasons. And look, everybody's dead now. But it was even personally depressing. Poor Bayek. Okay, well, I mean, did I like it? Um, I mean, basically, yes. Um, <laughs> that's a good point, girls. Um, so this is the first Assassin's Creed game I played and I played it just for Egypt and I think all the modern stuff is wacky and I don't really like it um, I just don't know that it added anything per se but it's part of the general Assassin's Creed story so I guess I prefer just murdering and no sci-fi. I like to think that whoever came up with the word assassin. <laughs> Rex. <laughs> but it was beautiful. Um, beautifully done Egypt. Lots of neat little tidbits. Uh, pretty, um, pretty good gameplay. Um, <laughs> Roz. And so, I mean, I think if anybody is interested in action stealth games, it's totally worth it. But I also don't think that, you know, anybody needs to play it either. But, uh, so next week, there's still a lot to explore, which is also very cool. So I will definitely give it that, like, look at all this stuff that I have to explore. 
post game. Oh, so many side quests, so many fast travels, and so that's a really cool thing. I think it's much better as an open world explore stabby game than gripping plot game. Um, or even gripping gameplay game. But next week, like I said, will probably be Kingdom Hearts. Let me look at my calendar. It might be a little bit of Kingdom Hearts just to make sure I finish Dream Drop Distance. Uh, but if not, I might do Shadow of War, which is a sequel to Shadow of Mordor, uh, which I played last year. So thanks for everybody for hanging out while I beat this game. I am going to ra raid um, my dear friend Stardust. She is playing another awesome action open world game, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn which um, I, I would recommend that more than this, that's for sure. Uh, so that's, that's where I stand, and I'll see y'all next time, though. Tuesday will be Kingdom Hearts for sure. Any more recommendations for new people to read? Just ask me. Thanks for us. I actually have, like, a ton of people up now. Devika and Avixius, and so there's lots of people.